Hello, this is Mike coming at you with a video of a little trade box that I received from Gary's Hot Wheels collection. And y'all check him out on YouTube. He's got some cool cars he shows and um, that he finds. And and um, I believe y'all enjoy it there, I guarantee you. Anyhow, I done removed my address off the box. But yeah, uh, we're going to get into this box and see if I can't show y'all what uh, what he sent me. He had been looking for the Bugatti and he hadn't had no luck finding the, that Bugatti. So I contacted him and told him, look, I got a Bugatti. Really don't care for it. And I'll trade it to you for something. And he said, well, what, what do you want? So I went to looking at his videos and I found something I wanted. So we made a trade and, and I, I sent him some extra stuff and he sent me a few extra items. But the main thing I traded the Bugatti for was this. It's be a La Trucka. I don't have, I didn't have one like this in my collection. The one with the fender skirts on it. And on the door, I was trying to see if it would focus. This dang phone won't focus for me, but it says Mike's on the door. Mike's Rod and Custom. So, uh, and I got an eight ball there with wings. But yeah, I would much rather have this truck sitting on my shelf in the collection than old Bugatti. Bugatti's are for uh people that like collecting those uh exotics but i'm not an exotic collector no and anyway the extra items he sent me is this it be the fish and chips and it's on a uh well i was gonna say it's on a blue card but it's not really a blue card i don't guess it says fish and chips on the side but underneath it, it says the heat fleet 11 whatever the 11 means and on the back it says it's from 2010 so he must have found this at one of his uh uh flea market finds there but anyway and next we have this matchbox 50th anniversary of the super fast and i'm sorry about the reflection it's kind of uh I got a dead gum light came on my camera today, I guess because it's a cloudy day. And that light is reflecting off the thing there, as you can see that dot. But anyway, this is a BMW i8 in gold. And I had just picked up one of these. Uh, only one I seen here just a couple weeks ago. And... Uh, Anyhow, now I got one I can open and one to keep carded. And anyway, uh, he uh, I had a, a, he had a video where he showed a blue Silverado four uh, door and a half truck. And I asked him, I said, "You got a green one like that?" And he says that he don't. He thinks he does. But anyway, guess what? He sent it to me. I didn't want him to send me this. I was asking him if he had one, because if he didn't, I was going to send him the one I got. But he sent me this. I guess he thought I was interested in it. So now i got two of them. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take one of them, and I'm going to take these ugly-looking wheels off this thing and put a regular set of wheels on it like it should be on a truck like this and see how it turns out. And the last item in the box, if I can get a hold of it, it's kind of big. And uh, well, it's, uh, it's oh goodness, let's see if we can get it out of here. here. We go. And the last one is the Dodge Ram four wheel drive with the Skyjacker logo. I have one, and it's uh, I think it's red that uh, SRGXIX sent me one. I believe it's red with a skyjacker, and this one be the white one. But if it's if it, if it's white, then that means I can keep that one carded, and I have this one here loose to put on the shelf with the loose ones. But yeah, 
But that's what uh, what I got from Gary's Hot Wheels collection. Once again, y'all check him out on YouTube. He got some cool stuff, I guarantee you. And anyhow, that's it for that. Now we're going to ease over here and I'll show y'all what I had found in the last couple of weeks that I haven't got around to showing. So anyhow, starting with this. I went to Target one day or one evening and found uh, these Corvettes. Uh, actually, I just got one of them. And then uh, the next day I went back and got a second one. And that was the same with this one. I got one on a Thursday and then I went back to Target and got the second one. And I believe they had two of these, but when I went back, they didn't have that second one. Someone had already got it. And this one, I can't remember if it was the second one or not, but I wasn't really interested in getting a second one of this one. I did those other ones. This here be the uh, Corvette convertible. And by golly, I went too fast probably on y'all. This one is, this is a 55, I believe. Yeah, 55 Corvette. And this is from the Throwback Series. And this one is a 73 Pontiac Firebird from the Throwback Series. This one here is the Dodge, what is it, Challenger SRT from the Throwback Series. And this Corvette is a C6. And it's from the Throwback Series. Excuse me about the daggum reflection there, guys. Like I said, my camera has got a light on it there today for some reason. I guess because it's kind of cloudy or something. Anyway, I found this Camaro. When I went back, I wanted to get a second one, but that second one that was there the day before was gone. So that was, uh, that's the way it goes. I didn't get a chance to get the second one on that one. And... On the first day, they had this one, but there was no second one, so I wasn't, uh, no big deal that there wasn't a second one the next day, because I knew from the day before, this is the only one of the 64 Impala. And by the way, this one is a 70 Camaro. Yeah. Anyhow, it was all from Target there. Well... The following week, on a Tuesday night, I went to Walmart. I'd been going to Walmart a lot, a lot there lately, and they didn't didn't have nothing new. But on that Tuesday after Thanksgiving, I went just to see. <coughs> excuse me, and the lucky me, they restocked finally. They had the quick bite. I already had this one quick bite. I had got it at Target uh, back there, I don't know, a few weeks back. So I wanted a second one, but they didn't have that one. So anyway, while I was at Walmart, I found the second one and got it. One to open, one to keep carded. Anyhow, I found this. This is C-Case 2020, the 8 crate. And I got two of them, one to keep carded, one to open. And next, I found only one of these. I don't know why, whether it was just one in the case or someone had done picked them all and missed this one or what. But uh, it'd be the 68 Chevy Nova in the camo. Happy to have this one. There's supposed to be two more versions of this one coming out uh, this year sometime. It'd be a different color, but it'd still be camoed and, uh, and uh, have the uh, mouthpiece on it there. I can hardly wait to see it and get one of them. But anyway, I found two of these. I'm not much on Porsches, but I got the white one. So I said, what the heck? I'll get the black ones to go with the white ones. Yeah. I think they had a blue one like this come out. and I, I think I missed out on getting the blue ones. But anyway... That's just the way it goes. And next, I found this Mustang. And I got two of them. 
Happy to have these for my collection. Even though I'm Mustang poor, these are some very nice Mustangs, most definitely. And next, I found this here Plymouth, I mean, uh, excuse me, Dodge Dart. Only one there. I tried to find a second one, but there wasn't one. I don't know what the deal is with that, but uh, at least I got one for now. Maybe I'll find another one one day. And next, we found the armored truck in chrome. And I got two of those. So, yeah. And next, I found the El Camino. All these, like I said, from C Case, 2020 C Case. So I got two of those. And I found a Roger Dodger from the 2020 C Case, but only one. Or I would have picked up two of them, I guarantee you. And next we have the Greenwood Corvette from the C Case. And I went ahead and got two of those. One to keep carded, one to open. And next, I found the Ford Escort. And I got two of those. And most definitely happy to have that. I got the black one and the white one, and now an orange one. And I also have the Fast and Furious blue and white one. And I also have another one. Uh, this red has the uh, castor oil on the side of it from a few years back. But, yeah, that's my finds for the last couple of weeks. Sure is. Anyhow, once again, y'all check out Gary's Hot Wheels collection. And uh, enjoy some of his videos. And I want to thank y'all for all you that support my channel and come by and talk to me and see my videos. I enjoy watching y'all's videos when I got time to and and I also uh but yeah y'all y'all come back now. And also happy hunting to y'all. And uh we'll catch y'all on the next one. And this is Mike. And I'm gone.